I'm just getting into this, but a lot of social users are taking advantage of all the free ideas and information on sites like Facebook and Pinterest to save money. Liza Danver shows how you can save thousands with a few clicks of the mouse. Recipes, crafts, makeup and hair tips, even planning entire weddings. Pinterest has quickly become the social media hotspot for easily changing up your routine. I do have some friends who really like Pinterest and get on there and find recipes and things like that. They like that. Do-it-yourself ideas are particularly popular. Anything save money. <laughs> I mean, groceries are expensive right now, so yeah. Yeah, I'd try it as soon as somebody tell me how to use it. <laughs> well, she's in luck. Christy Weber is a Pinterest expert. That was the number one reason why I was interested in Pinterest is because of the amount of money that you can save. The mother of five was able to plan her entire wedding for just $4,000. I don't think that I could have saved as much money as we did going into it without having Pinterest. This is Christy's Pinterest page. She tells me she was able to find dozens of low cost ideas for her rustic wedding on this site. She pinned them all to a special board. She tells me all she had to do was type in DIY rustic wedding. We did the wedding favor idea with the paper bags. Mm -hmm. Those were like $2. <laughs> Literally saving thousands of bucks by making all the reception decorations, which actually wasn't too time consuming thanks to friends and family. Network as much as possible, use social networking, Facebook, um, ask friends and family, see if they know anybody and take as much help as you can possibly get. Another penny pinching tip, borrow or gradually buy everything needed from waiting until bridesmaid dresses go on sale to rummaging through thrift stores and garage sales. Try to make a list of everything that you're going to need. Keep it in your purse. And as you go places, if you have some free time or a couple extra dollars, buy a little bit at a time. It's an easy plan that can also help you save money when planning your child's next birthday party, activities for a play date, or fun decorations for a cookout. That's what viewer Sandra May has done. Check out some of the pictures she sent us. Just a few more examples of how surprisingly penny-pinching Pinterest can be. Anybody can go to Hobby Lobby or or Walmart pick up an already to do craft item for their children to do. But if you can get on there and, and kind of learn more about how to do those things yourself that's in saving money, it, it makes it that much better. So, Liza Danver, ABC 22 News. We'd love to know how Pinterest and other social media sites have saved you money. Post us on our Facebook page or tweet us.